What's going on everybody? My name is CD and today we are going to be talking about the different editions of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War that are out there right now actually to pre-order on Modern Warfare on Warzone on the store also on PlayStation on the PlayStation Store I would assume also on the Microsoft Store and the Xbox wherever you want to purchase it also Battle.net will be the spot or Black Ops Cold War for PC as well. And there are three different editions that you can purchase for Cold War. That is the Standard Edition, the Cross-Gen Bundle, and the Ultimate Edition. Now you might be saying, okay, there's only three editions. How could this get confusing? Well, it really comes in with this cross-gen bundle and the next generation consoles coming out just a little bit after this next Call of Duty will drop. That makes things a little more confusing so let's just start with the standard edition everything we know about it right now so as you can see here you can pre-order right this second 59.99 for the standard edition nothing too crazy there but if you do purchase the digital standard edition you can upgrade it to the ps5 edition which will probably have enhanced graphics yada 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 for an extra ten dollars later on making you spend a total of 69.99 70 bucks now that is for playstation only right now so ps4 to ps5 versions the xbox one upgrade to the xbox series x is being evaluated i would assume it's gonna be something very similar but they haven't announced that quite yet so that's the digital edition now let's talk if you go into gamestop or walmart or whatever and you buy a physical edition if you buy the standard edition physically for the ps4 you can upgrade it again to the ps5 version for a fee and what you're going to do is you're just going to have to use that same ps4 disc that you bought and it'll just automatically be upgraded to a PS5 edition. You're not gonna get a new disc. But there is a digital edition of the PS5, so obviously you would need to buy the one with the disc tray because you need that PS4 Cold War disc to actually play it. So, so you gotta think through that a little bit if you're gonna be purchasing the physical edition. Just remember that not all PS5s are going to have a disc tray. And then also that was PlayStation. So again, if we're talking Xbox, the upgrade from the Xbox One to the Xbox Series X is still being evaluated. So we'll have to wait and see, but it'll probably be something very similar to PlayStation. And along those same notes, if you buy the standard edition for the PS4 and you get a PS5 and you don't upgrade it with that fee, you can still play it with the PS4 disc. It is backwards compatible, but you just don't get the upgrades that the PS5 game brings, which again is probably some graphics, yada, yada, yada. I don't know. And then final point, you can obviously only upgrade within the same console family. So if you buy it for PS4, you can only upgrade to PS5 version. You cannot upgrade and cross over to Xbox and same for Xbox. You cannot cross over into PlayStation. Ooh, okay. So now that most of the confusingness is done there, if you guys do have any questions, there'll be a link down below to an FAQ article that should answer any questions. It's a pretty long one. I'm trying to kind of skip through it, pick out the highlights, the points that most people want to understand. If you do pre-order this right here, right now, this or any other edition, you get access to the multiplayer open beta for Black Ops Cold War, which we don't know when that is coming out soon, probably in the next month or two, I would assume. I don't know. You get the instant reward of the Woods Operator Pack for Modern Warfare and Warzone. And then also a M4 blueprint and a voice quip finishing move, yada, 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 right now in Modern Warfare Warzone. All right, so next up on the list, they're trying to make it a little easier for you, right? The cross-gen bundle. So as you can see, the cross-gen bundle is $69.99. And I mentioned earlier, let's just talk PlayStation here. If you buy the standard edition and then you get a PS5, you have to upgrade with a $10 fee anyway, which puts you at $69.99. So if you know you're probably gonna be doing that, why don't you just purchase this now? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter either way, you're paying the same amount, but personally, I think this will be the edition that I'll be going for because I do plan on purchasing a PS5 and I do plan on playing Black Ops Cold War on it. And for me, it'll probably be all digital as that's just much easier for me at this time. But I can also get the digital only PS5, don't need that disc tray. So basically if you pre-order this, it's the same as the standard. You're still getting that open beta. You're still getting the woods operator pack, all the stuff, Modern Warfare Warzone. It's just gonna make it easier, right? When Cold War drops for me digitally, I'll be able to download it on my PS4. 
And then when the PS5 drops, I will also then be able to digitally download the PS5 version onto that. It'll be much easier. I don't have to pay that extra fee because I already put it into kind of the, the list price of the cross-gen bundle, I guess, the cross-gen edition. So hopefully that one made a little more sense. And then finally here, the last edition is the Ultimate Edition. Now the Ultimate Edition, as you can see here, $89.99. And what that comes with is everything from before. So you got the standard edition. You are also getting the cross generation edition. So you'll have it on PS4 and PS5 or whatever console you have now and the next gen console. And then you're also getting a little bit of Black Ops Cold War content. So you're getting the season one battle pass for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War, including 20 tier skips. You're getting the land sea air pack, which will be in Black Ops Cold War, which has three operator skins three weapon blueprints and three vehicle skins. And then as always, as I said, the other ones, if you do pre-order it, you're getting that open beta access and you're getting the woods operator stuff for Modern Warfare and Warzone. And then also as a bonus content in Modern Warfare and or Warzone, you're getting 10 instant tier skips for the battle pass there as well. I don't think that that's really worth anything to me, but I guess maybe to you it's worth spending another 20, 30 bucks on an addition. So I think that is, it. I think I covered most of it. If you guys do have any questions, as I said, you guys can put them in the comments down below or check out the link in the description. It hopefully will answer any questions you guys have about an addition or about the cross play or backwards compatibility or the next generation confusion that they've kind of made here with the game coming out right before the release of the next console. Now, one thing that I did have a question on that I want to put in right at the end, cross generation has nothing to do with cross play. You will always be able to play with your other friends on other consoles, no matter what edition you purchase. But with all that being said, if you guys did enjoy the video, if it helped you out, click that like button down below. So if you guys have not already, be on the lookout for more Black Ops Cold War content coming out here real soon. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys later.